Hey guys, it's Jason with Traditional Bow Hunting Wilderness Podcast. Take a second, I want to talk to you about this right here. This is my field sharpening kit that I always carry. I carry it in my arrow case here with me everywhere I go. And right now, uh, we're in a camper out here camping, and I'm using the time to sharpen up Bella's broadhead so they're ready for her for her, her bear hunt coming up. Wanted to show you this kit because it's been with me forever and it goes everywhere I want. Every place I go, I take this. Very similar kit at home. So what we have here basically is a piece of blue jean. Uh, right here and the purpose of that is I can take that I can put it right on my leg lock it right under there like that and I can use this and actually strop that broadhead right on there for my final stropping and run down there. I have stuff in my pocket there so put it here like this but I can like that jean trip that I showed you guys and I can actually do all my stropping right on my leg with that piece of um, of uh, jean so that's why that's in there so that's always carried there then here I have an arm guard Inside this arm guard, I have three things. I have, just like I do at home, I have my broadhead file, just a standard six inch, uh, you know, mill bastard file here. Broadhead, actually, this one's actually like a grizzly broadhead file, I think. I don't see it on there, but I believe it's an actual broadhead file uh, with a rounded steel on the side. So if I wanted to actually use it like a steel, I could. The sides are rounded and smooth. So it's an actual broadhead file. And then I have my two sharpening steels. This one is a fine grit right here that I barely ever use. I just still carry it. Um, and then this is my medium grit one. So that's my set. Now, the arm guard. This is the key thing right here. Uh, arm guard is an excellent, a leather arm guard is a fantastic stropping system for you to have. Now, not only is this an extra arm guard that I could take and actually put on, and use if I wanted to and have it as another arm guard so it gives me multifunctionality as a spare arm guard on there like that if I wanted to take it if I needed one but I take this and I roll it up like that I leave it rolled you can actually see this line on there right there see that line how it's all black on there right on there like that that is because that is where I strop so I take that I hold it in my hand so my fingers and my hands and everything are below it with that mound raised there and I strop on there just like this I go both ways on it and I do use this as an actual leather strop I do this at the bonfire pits I do this in my wall tent this is what I'm doing all the time when I have to sharpen my broadheads in in field or in camp this kit is with me um, in my arrow case here so I can do this so basically what I'm doing is I use say I shoot an arrow and I stick it in the dirt because I miss I, I, I missed once last time was like 1997 I think when I missed an animal uh, or it might have been three of them last year I can't remember which one it was but at any rate if you do miss something and you stick an arrow in the dirt when you get back to camp that night you can take your file reprofile that edge take my ceramic rod Touch it up and make sure everything is perfect on there. This head's about ready for stropping, so I'm not getting crazy. Like I said, I'm doing her arrows. Um, I guess I could with one of these that aren't ready yet. But So you take that, and being left-handed, this corner doesn't work real good for me. But And then once I have that filed and I get that thing honed and set like I want, then I, can, I, I don't use this one here. I carry it mainly as a backup. I could if I had to, but it takes way too long compared to the medium one. But then I can take this head run it on here and strop this back and forth like this and get that good strop on there and get it set and ready. And then when I'm done with that, I can take this piece right here and then I'll usually sit down for it, but I can take that and set it again right on my leg, get that stretched out like I want with that sitting on my leg. And then I can actually do my final stropping with this on here this way and get it all set. So that's my actual field kit that I run here and how I do it, but it's always with me. Sweet, simple, and easy. It does give you the option of having a spare arm guard with you, with you, which is really nice. And everything just fits right inside of it, just like that. Gets put in there, wrap the strap around there, just like so. And then I take that and I wrap it right around the blue jeans. And then this whole kit just sits right here like this, this whole thing just goes right into my arrow case, right in there and tucks right in in that back corner. And when these fold over, it just sits right in there nice, sweet, and easy. So that kind of shows you my field kit and how I set it up on there for you. So you have all your sharpening stuff with you in your arrow case, ready to go for when you're in camp and you have to resharpen things. So thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye.